Hi, I'm Venda Millis, and every time I look at all the weird things that have been happening this year, I think that history is repeating itself. If we go back to somewhere around 2008, I was working with a lot of foreclosures, and one of my tasks, which I did not enjoy, was giving cash for keys letters. And I was giving a cash for keys letter to this one little lady, she was in her 80s, and the letter said that if she left her house in a timely manner and she left it in good shape, they would give her $2,500 for her to start her life again. Well, she was visibly upset. She invited me in, gave me something to drink, and we sat and chatted for a few moments. And she told me that her and her husband had worked for this house for over 20 years. Then he got sick, and about three years previous to our visit, he passed away. She wasn't used to handling financial matters, but she did the best she could. And since they'd gone through their savings, she ended up getting a small line of credit on her house. But then one month she had a pretty major car repair and she couldn't make ends meet. So what she did was skip her house payment so she could get every, everything else, which probably was not the wisest move on her part, but that's what she did. She tried to get caught up the next month, but then she had trouble the month after. And all of a sudden she was in over her head. She could not get on top of things. It was like a snowball rolling down the hill. Interest was adding up, fees, penalties. By the time she finished her story, we were both in tears. But my tears were of frustration because there was not a thing in the world that I could do for her at that point. There were a lot of other cases that were similar to this. And since that point, I've lost my own husband and worked really hard to get back on top of things. I've decided I'd like to help people like the lady I just told you about. I have a small fund and I've developed an LLC, it's called Bitterroot Mortgage Assistance Program. If you're about to fall behind on the mortgage payment, I'd like to know about it so that I can help you. Now, this is not associated with any banks, it's not associated with the government, it's just me, myself, and I. But I do have a, a small amount of money that I can loan you so that you don't miss that first payment. That first payment is what is so important and I will help you for up to three payments in a year. Now, if you can't get back on top of things with three payments, then we need to talk. You know, maybe we need to look at a lifestyle change. Maybe you need to refinance. I know a lot of very good lenders. Maybe there is a forbearance or a loan modification program that will help you. Maybe you need to, to sell your home, but at least we can explore your options and see what will work best for you. My goal, and hopefully yours, is so that we can keep your credit intact and so that you don't lose what you've been working for. So if you find yourself in this position or someone you know, give me a call at 370-1747 and we'll talk, see what we can do.